Yesterday in China, we saw the debut launch of the Long March 12A. This is a large modification from the Long March 12, switching the propellants over to methane and liquid oxygen and adding landing legs. The four first stage engines on the 12 are replaced by seven smaller engines on the 12A, enabling them to perform a powered landing. At least in theory, because while the upper stage successfully reached orbit, the booster unfortunately did not land successfully. A spaceflight fan in China was able to capture this amazing shot of the booster descending at very high speeds and apparently burning at both ends. Based on satellite imagery, it was over a mile off target, which probably indicated that the failure happened at relatively high altitude, and according to some sources, this may have happened during the atmospheric entry burn. This rocket recovery program has been in development for a while. Back in June 2024, a subscale version was flown. This used the same tank diameter and the same engines, but a much shorter booster. They were able to fly this to an altitude of 10 kilometers and then successfully return to the landing site. But for the full scale booster, it went higher and faster and they couldn't quite pull that off. But they did succeed in getting the second stage into orbit. So now the question is, are they going to begin using this as a launch vehicle and iterate on the landing process? Or are they going to skip forward to the Long March 12B, which is bigger still?